Hello guys, this is Rahul and today we will be talking about how to do uh, fundamental analysis uh, which is uh, which is a part of uh, stock market analysis on the BSE market, the Bombay Stock Exchange market and we will be seeing how to build on that. So I created a directory fundamental analysis BSC and I will be opening up that you know, sublime text. I'll be using sublime text. I'll just yeah. I'll just maximize the code. So I'll open that folder. Okay. So what is that? Yeah. I'll open that folder, create a new file, save it as simple. Because you know, simple things matter more than complexity things. You know, complexity things don't last. Don't last. So I'll be. Uh, what we'll be doing is creating a function. Do it. Uh, down. Download data. Stock. and then uh, I'll just yeah then I'll be source is equal to pd dot read uh, first I'll import pd is pandas I'll be using the pandas library to extract this is the first part of our thing like I forgot to mention is downloading the actual fundamental data of our stock so fundamental indicators of the stock and that can be various things which I have a list of them I will list it out afterwards but fundamental analysis can be debt to equity ratio the EBITDA ratio the and many things and many things so I'll be uh, yeah this is the first part so I'll be just downloading that data pd.read so I'll be downloading that data from read HTML. I'll be downloading the data from like take any company moneycontrol.com okay I'll just go for JK tires and go to ratios and these are the list of ratios we are interested in we'll just extract this whole thing and doing a simple copy paste doesn't like is too boring so we'll be using the pandas libraries so we'll be reading this what this does is uh, let's print it out print the source out so the data we need maybe in some what this does is, is, is converts the HTML page into a set of tables and we'll just run that simple okay I've not called I've not called download data of stock okay so I get this data and maybe and the thing we need is at the third call third row third row yeah the third index so we, we, what we'll be doing is gathering this whole thing and the data we need is in the third row so what will we do is uh, we'll, we'll just take the data from the and we just need to uh, remove this NANS alright 
man's this this per share ratios and that's it yeah we should remove that so what we'll be doing is uh, we'll be taking the, the third index we'll be just removing this stuff and saving this from this row till the last all right the third table here yeah. so we just df is equal to source 3 fine so i'll be uh, and renaming the columns because we dropped the columns as you have seen we are just taking the ratios from this side and we'll be eliminating this first part which has the column names so what we'll be doing is yeah we'll just draw uh, rename the column names equal to ratio march 18 march 17 march 16 mar 15 mar 14 so as you seen we just rename this uh, row uh, is this column as ratio then we just use this values as a column names here and so what we'll be doing is we will convert this to a csv file and store an audit and our file uh, folder we'll create a new folder here bsc so everything which uh, we what we download is uh, based on a ticker like this let's copy this ticker dot csv i'm not uh, automating this part because uh, i'm not uh, that can be done by uh, you i'm just focusing on the financial part now and we'll just do that so what will we doing is python so we have converted it i think let's check it out let's see our file yeah so we have the file we have everything we need we have the ratio we need so we need just need to uh, now store this data like we can do this for many companies like jk cement all right go to ratios financials go to ratios copy the whole thing i'm not automating this part you can that can be done by you i'm too bored to automate just copy this bsc tag yeah so let's try this out now apparently we did get okay yeah so we got the files we got the data so yeah you can do this for every every stock and save it in your bsc folder and that's it for